about them, Matthias. We have collected some of your highlights of your career highlights. in photos. <laughs> so maybe you could tell us a little bit about this first one. It looks like a photo model, huh? <laughs> okay, that's right. <laughs> you see this young boy? What do you remember um, of that time when you first signed for the club? That's right. This was my one of my first season, mm -hmm. like a professional football player by Borussia München Gladbach. Mm -hmm. They make last season the third place in the German Championship. They qualificate for the Champions League, and this was my favorite club. I was fan of this club when I was a child. Oh really? I support wow. them. Yeah. Günter Netzer was playing there, Jupp Heinges was playing there, Bertie Fuchs was playing there, oh, great idols. names. And yeah. this was my idols and uh, later I had the chance to play in my favorite club. Mm -hmm. It was amazing. I had five wonderful years in Borussia München Gladbach. Perfect. Let's move on to yeah. the next one. Oh, we have a second page in this yep. photo album. There's oh, more. There's more, 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 more pages. This That's the German team. Yes, Which this one is a are German there? team. Yes, I am here on the right side oh, in the are. middle. Yes, I think this was a German team. Uh, 1984. 1984, yes. Yeah. Oh, not a good memory because uh, 1984 we played the European Championship in France mm. and we was going home okay. after the first round. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, we lost uh, our final game in the group stage against Spain, 1-0 in the last minute, mm -hmm. and uh, sure was not a good result. And after this tournament, Franz Beckenbauer come like a new coach to the German national team. Mm -hmm. But bad memory. Bad memory yes. with France? No, or not oh, with France. Okay. With, <laughs> with the with result, team. with okay. the team, yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, with France I have only the best yes. experience, okay. yes, yes, the best memories with him. He was, uh, he's not only a great coach, he was a, he's a good friend of mine. Yeah. But uh, memory in this, not uh, so with this team, it was not so good, no, no, no. We go to the next <laughs> okay. page. Moving on to the uh, next one. Mm -hmm. German That's championship a good memory title. Over there. Yes, you see, we celebrate <laughs> something, huh? Yeah. We get something, yes. This, uh, we won the German championship uh, 1996 mm -hmm. again in the last game at home against Borussia München Gladbach. Uh, we won yeah we won 6-0. We won 6-0. Yeah. 6-0 and uh, Werder Bremen the concurrent of the title mm -hmm. they has to lose in Stuttgart. Yeah and they, and they lost 2-1 okay. and for this this was a very emotional championship for us. Yeah. Even though it wasn't, you can see it. It was it was your third title as well, right? This was my second title. Oh, your second but title. But one year later, I won the third title. Yes. Ah, okay, yes. okay. I can recognize because this was a this was a dressing room from Bayern Munich in the Olympia Stadium. This mm -hmm. I can see and I remember. Eighty-seven, we won the title in a away game. Oh, this okay. means we this was the second one. Yeah. Sure. So this was a home. And game. I know the same the players. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> this was the second title. Yes. All what? Right. It's a good title. Yeah. Very nice, yes. Uh, wow. Highlight of your career? Highlight. Yep. Highlight. Uh, a, a summer night in Rome, in the Olympia Stadium in Rome. Mm -hmm. yeah, Olympia Stadium, Munich, Olympia Stadium in Rome. Yeah. I like the Olympia Stadium, yeah. yes. I have good memories. <laughs> good memories there. Yes, uh, 8 of uh, July uh, 1990, the World Cup final against Argentina. A big celebration with uh, my colleague Litbarski and Andy Preme, who scored the penalty in the mm -hmm. in the final, mm -hmm. and uh, with 80,000 German fans in the stadium mm -hmm. because this was a home game for us. A lot of yeah. Germans was there, and the Italian support Germany in this yeah. time because we had uh, many players from Germany who played in the Italian Championship, like mm -hmm. Jürgen Klinsmann, like Rudi Völler, mm -hmm. like Andy Preme or myself. Yeah. How were the celebrations after that? Uh, a long party uh, long till the party. next morning. Um, Didn't sleep. Uh, sure, we slept one and a half hour. Andy Prim, we had a double room in this time. The players were sleeping in one room together. Two players were sleeping in one room together. Yeah. And I slept with Andy Premier all the World Cup, eight weeks uh, in one room. And this wow. was, this was uh, really a wonderful time. We had a lot of fun. We had good results. And uh, sure, uh, with a highlight uh, after the, uh, the World Cup final. Uh, celebrate with the team, a long yeah. party till the morning, then we slept one and a half hour and then our plane was going back to Germany to Frankfurt mm -hmm. and then in Frankfurt we celebrate with another Even five, six hundred thousand people wow. on the street, on the square. Big party after the World Amazing. Cup, but I think it's not only good for the players, the same for, for the German for football. Th for the fans as well. Yeah, for yeah. the fans as well, yes. Next picture again. 
a, a title with uh, Bayern Munich. Uh -huh. I think this was a title 1996 or 97. Mm -hmm. uh, Giovanni Trapattoni was a coach and uh, sorry, I have to tell <laughs> this is a game. We won the title before, yeah. but we get always the cup after the last game day. Okay. And our last game day was by my ex-club Borussia München Gladbach. This okay. means what I didn't won with Borussia München Gladbach, yeah. I won with Bayern Munich and celebrate in the stadium of Borussia München Gladbach. Oh, oh. <laughs> uh, how is that? They're bittersweet, right? Yeah, in one way nice, but uh, <laughs> in another way, uh, the memory, uh, what you didn't want 10, 15 years before in this club, you won yeah, with Bayern won Munich. With yeah, this was not only a happiness feeling, this was the same emotional feeling. Mm, mm. Then? This was a Champions okay. League match. Th th thank you very much. You remember <laughs> me this game, huh? You're a fan of Manchester United? No, I'm no. not. No, I'm not you're a, not? I'm not a fan of Manchester. Okay. I okay. wish that you had this This uh, really was uh, um, some game what I like to forget. This was the Champions League final 1999 in Barcelona against Manchester United. We dominate the game 90 minutes. Yeah. This was possible. was 1 0 for us. This was possible to score the second, the third goal, the fourth goal. Manchester United didn't exist in this final, 89, 90 minutes. And then in the overtime, they scored two goals after they two got corner lucky. They got lucky. Yeah, but this is football. We maybe mm. was, uh, we celebrate too early. We mm. was not, uh, we was, was, we was not waiting the final whistle of the, of the referee. Yep. And we celebrate maybe <laughs> too early. We was not any more concentrated and focused for the last two minutes for the overtime. And yep. Manchester United scored two goals in the overtime after two uh, corner kicks yep. and uh, in this way we lost the uh, Champions League final. Very stupid. <laughs> you see the picture? N no celebration. Yeah, no celebration there. Yeah. Everybody with your heads down. Yes, Ottmar Hitzfeld was a coach here in Mehmet Scholl. Mm -hmm. yeah, but this, uh, yeah. And then you have to see how Beckham celebrate with his team. Uh, well. No, <laughs> we go to the next page. <laughs> That's you joining the MLS. MLS, yes. Yep. I finished my career in uh, America. Mm -hmm. I played for the Metro Stars. Metro Stars, uh, each five, ten New years, they change the name. Yep. Uh, before was Cosmos New York, mm -hmm. then was the Metro Star New York, now is Red Bull New York. Red Bull Car. Yes, and uh, this was, uh, I was uh, uh, soon 40 years old, 39, yep. and uh, I was looking for some new experience, and uh, I was going for this one season for eight months to mm. New York. It mm. was a nice time. We played uh, the semi-final in the Cup, the semi-final in the, in the championship. I think this was a good result for, for, the, for this young uh, mm -hmm. team from New York. And uh, I had a good experience and uh, yeah. So you ended my your career there. I ended my career there, yes, exactly. But that was the beginning of your managing career. I think we have a photo of that oh, next. next. Yeah, then I was uh, coached by Rapid Vienna, yes, uh -huh. it's a traditional club in Austria. Uh, was only the problem that the club didn't have money, we had to work with a uh, lot of young players. Uh,